Hey everybody, I'm Ben Mankiewicz, welcome to TCM. Director Stanley Kubrick's landmark 1968 science fiction epic, 2001 A Space Odyssey, remains among the most talked about science fiction movies ever made. It had dazzling Academy Award winning visual effects and thought provoking things to say about the modern world, along with some not so easily interpreted symbolism. As a result, despite its box office success, 2001 was not a film that cried out for a sequel. But a sequel did come anyway, 16 years later in 1984, though set only nine years after the events in the first film. We have the sequel coming up next. It's from MGM in 1984, 2010. On the posters and in the trailers, the title 2010 was followed by the tagline, The Year We Make Contact. It's the story of a joint Soviet-American space expedition to Jupiter. Their objective is to investigate what happened to the spaceship from the original 2001 voyage. You don't have to know 2001 to enjoy 2010. Like any sequel, though, it only helps if you have seen the original. The story is based on an Arthur C. Clarke novel. Clarke also worked with director Stanley Kubrick to create the plot of the original film. Kubrick himself had no involvement in the sequel, but is said to have given his blessing to the man who produced, directed, wrote, and shot it, Peter Hyams. The cast includes Roy Scheider, John Lithgow, Helen Mirren, and if you've seen the original 2001, you'll recognize actor Keir DeLay, who briefly reprises his role as astronaut Dave Bowman. From 1984, here's 2010. <laughs>